So, Coach, mm -hmm. uh, third spring practice, first in pads. How's it going overall? It was go going really well. Um, happy just to be back out here, excited to see the guys, uh, able to get good, clean reps. You know, uh, being just being the first day of pads, you, you wanted to come out with no injuries or anything, so it was somewhat of a good, great day. What went into uh, and what was your input for to get him to return? I'm, I'm pointing to yeah, Zach Charbonnet. Just, yeah, um, I think it was more of just what Zach wanted to do. You know, just um, I'm sure he wanted to finish school, graduate, and um, just, you know, I think he had a plan when he came to college, and I think he just wants to execute that. So it really wasn't anything of what me saying or anybody telling him. It was just what he wanted to do on his own. Did you have some input into it? Did he ask your opinion? I mean, I mean you I, might know about the NFL, right? Yeah, exactly. But, you know, I just, it was his decision. I, I would love to have him come back. If he left, I would just going to understand. But it was just more of a, I'm here to support him either way he goes. But I'm glad he's back. So now you got to replace Britton Brown and mm -hmm. find a number two guy. How yeah. do some of the younger guys look? So uh, they're looking really good. Uh, we have Kashmir Allen, um, Keegan Jones, Deshaun Morrell, and um, I my freshman TJ. TJ Harden's here, so I'm just excited for those guys. The, the two older guys, uh, Kaz and Keegan, are doing really well, so I think we'll be in a good spot with those. Is it easier to evaluate these guys now they have pads on today? Almost oh, definitely. It's hard to, to, you know, when you're in pajamas, it's just, it's not really football. Did that guy surprise you today? Um, no, same guys still flash. You know, when you when you, when you you have it, you, you can see their ability no matter what's going on. It's just basically how they practice. How does Zach look different or improved or just physically different since you last saw him out in the field? Um, just body-wise, he's bigger. You know, um, he's still the same guy. He, he, he comes to practice no matter what. He's ready to practice. He goes hard. Um, you don't. He doesn't say much. You don't have to say much to him. He motivates himself. He's just a. He's a guy that's out here fine-tuning. He's a pro that's fine-tuning his skills to for the next level. So. Having to replace three offensive linemen, how is that? And obviously that's key to success to your group. How have they looked so far, do you think? O-Line's doing a good job just knowing that there's, like you said, three new guys in there. So I'm excited to see where it's going to go. We should have grad transfers coming in also. So this is a good time for the young guys to get the reps and really get evaluated before those other guys get here. Mm -hmm. That seems to really help him later on, right? Yes. Is that, how do you try to do that? Is it just all hands? It's just working on uh, catching the ball for me, jugs, just putting them in just different situations to to catch the ball. Because he can catch. It's not. It's just us using him in that. You know what I mean? S similar to Josh Kelly. He went to the senior bowl. Guys were really uh, surprised he could catch. But it's just that we didn't use him in that role because we had Felton and stuff like that, but Zach's gonna get an opportunity. He exactly, he's gonna get an opportunity That's to catch passes. Yes, he, can he can catch. catch. For he... Some people you can say you can't catch. Very, very true, yes, <laughs> but he's not one of those. He's not... one, of, mm -hmm. one other thing, punt returns. You gotta replace Kyle Phillips. Yes. Uh, who, are you, who are you looking at to step into that role? Um, we have Logan Loya, we have Kaz Allen, Keegan Jones, Bobo, Titus, uh, Cam Brown. So we have a lot of guys that have actually caught in. Cam Brown's caught in the SEC. Bobo's caught in the ACC. Um, Titus is caught at Central Florida. So there's guys that have caught punts in, in situations, but we just need to see, find out who's going to be the guy. But I'm excited for the group of guys that I have for that. Mm -hmm. It's going to be hard to replace Kyle, but I'm excited for it.